Hello guys, we have successfully completed our first use case, that is the login page. In this process, we have learned different concepts like HTML, CSS, JavaScript, jQuery, SX, how to connect with the database, and the concept of session variable, to which we can pass information from one page to another page. Now, this is time to develop the second use case. Our second use case will be to develop this particular page. Now, the name of the page is Edit Program Details. As the name itself indicates, this program or this page or this use case will allow the user to keep track of all the different programs offered by an institute. So by default, when this page is loaded for the first time, it will display all the programs which are there in the database. Along with that, it will also give the user these options through which the user will be able to insert new program into the database. Now see here, this feature we are going to learn here. Like as soon as I click on this button, see here, this pop-up window is coming up. Like how to do that, we'll be learning that concept. And also one more thing I want to show you here. See, uh, say suppose the user writes here a name of the program, some code of the program, and this department, as soon as the user clicks on this drop down menu it loads automatically all the different departments which are there in the database so this thing we are going to learn uh, when we develop this particular use case okay and also see here along with each row there is this button coming as soon as the user clicks on this particular button another pop-up window comes and there automatically these fields are filled up with the values corresponding to that particular row if the user wants to do any change there, the user will be able to do the change and then the user will be able to click on that submit button. That will allow the user to update a particular row there in the database. So all these things we are going to learn in, in this particular use case. So if you're interested, please let me know it in the comment section.